We've been traveling on Cunard since 2007. We've been doing world cruises together for about 30 years. We've started out with just a, a crossing from New York to London. And we did that for several years and then we started to do segments of the world cruise. And he said, that's it, from now on we go all the way. And then we began and we've had 13 years of world cruises. I had never even seen a cruise ship. So my first cruise was around the world for 80 days. We decided to do it with the idea that we would try it, and if she didn't like it after a few days, we would leave. Since then, I can't get her off the ships. I get up, I have my routine. I go to the gym, I work out, I'm there a couple hours, I come back. I'll try, if I can catch him at a lecture, he'll save me a seat. We look at the schedule in the morning to see if there's something really good. Let's go to lunch, go to the movies at two o'clock, go to tea at four o'clock, my other favorite thing. Love the tea. There's so much to do. Or you can do nothing. You can sit on your balcony and read a book all day if you want. You can live the routine you want. I think that there's something extremely special about getting dressed up, going to an elegant dinner. You don't have to get dressed up, but we like that. This is my cruise closet. This is the place where you put the things that you only wear when you're getting ready to go on one of the Cunard ships. We do look at these dresses sometime and say, oh, remember, this is the dress I wore to the World Cruise dinner, or this is the dress I wore to the captain's table the first night. A black and white ball, well, this is one thing you could wear to black and white ball. It's black and white. The elegance of Cunard, which I think is something they have that nobody else has. There's something about that British elegance that I think is exceptional on all three of the ships. Over the years, we have made so many friends. And on the World Cruise, we know people who live in all these places. Well, we enjoy it so much because we have made friends that do the World Cruise repeatedly. It's not only the people that you meet on the ships that are from all the different countries, but they always have people from other countries too. So you meet them. Thank you, yes, good morning. Don't I look like Madonna? We had Archbishop Desmond Tutu a couple of years ago when we did the Queen Mary II World Cruise. He was the cutest thing in the world and he spoke and it was such a joy to even be in the same room with this great man. We've been traveling on world cruises on Cunard Line for over 30 years. <laughs> We've seen the world on Cunard ships. We've been at sea about 600 days out of the last five years. Love my life on the ships. I love going on these world it's voyages. Fun. Photo album. Most importantly, we've gotten to travel together, which has really been the, the most extraordinary experience of all. We enjoy going on Queen Mary too, because it's like home to us. You have an oceanfront home for three and a half months. Yeah. Not all bad.